So every year we come to this part and there's always these um, pumpkins, I couldn't even think what they were called then. But this one's actually got Donald Trump on it and I just think it's amazing. I don't know whether they actually do this themselves or whether they just get someone to make it for them. What's going on guys, welcome to today's vlog. It is Wednesday the 31st of October, it's Halloween today. Finally it's here. So we are just about to get ready and go out with the kids and do a Halloween trick or treat live. If you haven't seen this live stream, it'll be coming up here and it'll be coming up at the end of the video. I've already done the pumpkin. Do you wanna see the pumpkin? Check my pumpkin out. So basically what we've done is, he's spewing his whole insides out. It couldn't be more perfect for us. Spewing up all over the plate. He's got all his innards here. He's got bits coming out of his nose. He just looks absolutely awesome. So, you may have noticed over the last month or so that we have basically not even tried when it comes to vlogging. We've not even done anything. It's been the same thing over and over again. But we have got massive, massive announcements coming in the next two to three weeks when it comes to this channel we are also going to be launching a new channel in new year which i can't wait for i really can't wait for completely different to this not really family orientated whatsoever but still carries the our family logo so it's going to be a tiny bit different i know there's a lot of people that might already guess what it is there's a lot of people that aren't going to have a clue what it is but it's very different we are starting to get the equipment for it now right now we have already picked the people that are going to be doing the channel with us some of them work on radio some of them work on youtube some of them work in other places it's going to be immense when it happens this isn't a channel that's going to have like a video every week we're probably going to put a video up once a month or once twice a month something like that maybe a few more in between we might be able to break up episodes into threes and fours i haven't got a clue yet we haven't got a format written down locked down yet so when we do you're gonna know about it but it is coming and it is gonna be absolutely fantastic it's something that's very very close to my heart sarah's it's, it's gonna be immense it really is i can't say anything else we have also got other things on the horizon for the our family channel as well some of something that might come into fruition in the next week or so so then i can finally announce that to you as well hopefully fingers crossed i've got a telephone meeting tomorrow morning with I'm not even going to say it. I've got a telephone conversation tomorrow morning. If it, if it pulls off, it pulls off. If it doesn't, it doesn't. It's one of them things. But I'm not going to say what it is because if it doesn't happen, I'm going to look like a bit of an idiot. And I don't like looking like an idiot much. And honestly, I don't. So the kids are all ready. They're all dressed up in the Halloween gear. It's going to be a weird one tonight because I'm going to be going live with the camera, the phone. We're also going to be ringing this because it's going to be trick-or-treating as well. It's just going to be bizarre. It's going to be weird because we haven't done this before. We don't know if it's going to go right. We don't know if it's going to go wrong. We don't know if we're going to lose signal. We don't know whether it's going to just stop. We haven't got a clue. We're just going to play it by ear. But hopefully, we're going to get quite a few people on enjoying the trick-or-treating with us. Because it's going to be pretty epic. So without further ado, we need to get this 2018 Our Family Halloween officially started. Oh. And if you don't like jump scares, maybe not watch the rest of this. So we finally got out trick or treating. The kids have been around the estate near us and we've done a couple of other estates. So <clears throat> we've just like 
they filled the buckets and they've absolutely got loads of stuff. I'm surprised actually, they've actually got more doing. They've been out less time this year and already filled the buckets twice <laughs> than they did last year, but <coughs> maybe there's just more people stayed in this year. It seems to be a quiet one this year because there's a few other people that we've actually knocked on the doors and obviously they know us from like previous years and they've said like they usually have a party every year yeah, yeah, and yeah. this year they've not yeah. even had a party so, but there's actually a clip that we sh will be in the vlog and he had all different kind of um, pumpkins on his garden it was just really really amazing I think it's just so good you know all the different pictures you can actually put into a pumpkin and the effort that people go to for just one night so the kids keep asking can we get them so we're going to look for someone that actually does them designs them or something like because obviously i can't do it dave probably could because he's pretty good at stuff like that so but yeah we'll probably get some for the party that we are going to do next year So every year we come to this part and there's always these um, pumpkins, I couldn't even think what they were called then, but this one's actually got Donald Trump on it and I just think it's amazing. I don't know whether they actually do this themselves or whether they just get someone to make it for them, but check this out, this is so good. This one's like a skeleton and then this one's got Donald Trump's face on it. How cool they actually look they're absolutely amazing i just think someone that can take the time and actually like cut that out in sorry my phone's ringing that'll be clever to have to wait um take the time to like cut it out and put them out i think it's just really good it's very um artistic a minute ago was You can see that Dave is actually dying to knock on the doors and fill his pockets with sweets. Hey, I'll go for all the kids later. Hey, I'll go for all the kids later. I'll take what I want, leave them all the crap ones. And I'll, well, they don't because they usually get home and say, "Mom, mom and dad, what do you want first? So, but they feed us on the way round. So, yeah. <laughs> Oh, look at all that candy! Oh my god, you've got more than me! Yeah, I'm not bothered. <laughs> I'll, grab, I'll grab just that phone now. Thank you! <laughs> See you later. And Elopez, do you like trick or treating? Yeah, just so you can get sweets. <laughs> no, stop kisses. Yeah, it's, it's Halloween. It's the only time we actually get to knock on strangers' doors and get no. food. <laughs> Part of chocolate country. You look so good. You all look so good, don't you? <laughs> and this is Oscar. Put your mask down, let everyone see. Oh, don't you look good? Yeah, we can't hear us. I know, look at all that in there. Where are we going out, aren't we, Mum? Yeah, they're the ones you couldn't climb up last year. They're the frozen stairs, Yeah. Are you Elsa? No. Oh, you're a witch tonight, aren't you? Forgot your stairs. She was in the bedroom before when I was getting a dress. Well, Imogen did her makeup and her hair while I was um, cleaning up. And she stood in front of the mirror and she went, Mum, I'm a witch. I went, well, you're not really a real witch. She went, I am. <laughs> yeah, show them the blood on your face. 
Oh my god, you were caught, weren't you? Oh god. <laughs> you do look super cool though, don't you? And she knows it. This is Chloe again. So we'll check back in soon and let's see what else the kids get up to. So we've just gone to a house and I've actually oh wait one minute, I'm not even focused. Why well, am I not focused? Focus. Huh? And um, I actually finally got my favourite chocolate in the whole world. Oh, a cruncher. Guys, I finally got a cruncher. Oscar, at least you can bring your co out when you go back. I was just like, oh my god, I'm not even going to get a cruncher tonight because they're not even a big thing. And I got a cruncher. Yes. I Didn't got you get one, one as well. well. I got one as well. Imogen did it for Makeup tips. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, so we've got back now from trick or treating. And as you can see, Mason and Porsche have took the tree to pieces. It is now no longer a Halloween tree. It will be tomorrow, the start of a Christmas tree, what it should be. So the kids have been taking the decorations down slowly. Sarah's been sorting the decorations out, getting rid of all the old stuff that we don't need anymore. You know, all the crap. Keep these, or get rid of them. <coughs> ones. Don't go and get the leathers. No, I'll reach them off in a minute. So she'll be down tomorrow, the witch. All these other decorations will be coming down as well. We've got decorations that were on here, they've come down now. Round here, they've come down now. Mm -hmm. This come down now. That's still not printed. In fact, it started smoking before. Didn't it, babe? Yeah. Really bad. So I think it's the, uh, it's the extruder, which is unfortunate. So that's where we're up to, up to now. We've been out trick-or-treating the kids. I've got an absolute rake of sweets. Just check out what Penelope got. She got a full bucket full. I mean, she was just taking handfuls at a time, like a grabber machine. She didn't care whatsoever. I want to go home now. And then when she got up, and actually emptied a bucket and her hands warmed up, she was like, I want to go back out now. Yeah, she wanted to go back out then, a little witch. So that's where we're up to now. We're slowly getting these decorations down and then we're going to end today's vlog. One eternity later. All right, just got out of the shower now. My hair is absolutely wild. I think it's, I think you can actually put it in a ponytail now at the back, which would be kind of, look at it. I've never had hair that long ever in my life. I feel like I should be doing a L'Oreal advert because I'm worth it. Um. Yeah, the tree is now completely bare. It is ready for the lights tomorrow. Just a few more Halloween decorations to put away and then we're all set to get everything ready for Christmas. That printer over there is an absolute pain in the ass, like you wouldn't believe. It's horrendous. He'll be turning into um, Santa's little helper very soon, much to his disgust. Right, Max? Right? No? Maybe. So it looks like I've got to order another part. The extruder, which is part of this, basically. This drives the filament in. But as you can see from this that went on tonight, it's all black and worn and spewing out and smells rotten. So it smoked its ass off earlier this evening. Not good at all. It's like the bane of my life now, that printer. But I will win. I always do in the end. So, with that said, and on that printer meltdown bombshell, thanks to everybody who has stuck by us throughout the whole of Vlogtober. I know the vlogs have been getting really tedious because it shows with the views they've started to dip again now at the end. But we'll bring it back up, don't worry. We'll bring it back, back into line again. I'm sure of that. So do not forget to smash the like button, subscribe if you're not already, make sure you click the notification bell. It does nothing. Make sure you leave us a comment and we will see you guys tomorrow because we do this every single day.